What's up guys, Barry Gaming here, back with some more Idol Heroes, and today on the Royalty Meme Team, we got a couple things we need to do. First off, I really want to keep pushing this Tower of Oblivion, but this wave is just kicking our booty. Good lord, can we not get past it. Ugh, we don't really have much we can upgrade here either, although actually we got a few, wait, Oh, wow. Actually, hold on. We got him all the way up to 200. Not too bad. Okay. I actually wasn't, I wasn't expecting that. That was a nice little pleasant surprise. So, okay. I take it back. Maybe we can get a little progress. Um, yeah, we're going to do 10 more in Sealand as well, because let's be honest, I, I want to beat Sealand. I want to get it done. I want it to be over with and I want to finish. Only we had more gold because one thing I noticed on this account as well, we have an absolute ton of gear, but we have no gold. So if you guys remember in the news video the other night, told you all about the hand of Midas, this thing right here is going to be changing tonight. Or actually, I guess it was last night because I'm recording this before the update. But uh, I can't wait to see what happens when it goes live. This account, I'm, I have 42,000 gems. I'm probably going to sink an absolute ton into it so I can upgrade tons of gear, get more six-star sets. That way we can run the proper setup on our Delacium. We can re-roll our gems a bit more as well. Crit, crit attack. Hmm. I think, I think I like the skill damage, holy damage better, honestly. I think it's better. But I do want to jump in here one more time just to see. You know, I wonder if 25% HP and 25% all damage reduced versus a lower amount. I think we'll keep what we have for right now. But the other thing I was remembering too is our July growth plan is almost done. And then we will have King of Demons that we can throw hopefully on our Cthulhu. And I'm hoping that helps us out. I'm hoping it does. You've listened to me talk for two minutes. We haven't done a damn thing. <laughs> Let's get into it. Oops, yeah, not that one. That one right there. Okay, so this is a dangerous combo right here. I want to try to run the Delacium. I need him to live, though, and getting him to live is going to be near impossible. Oof, yeah, that's, that's pretty impossible. So we're going to try putting Cthulhu in slot one, I think. Put Cthulhu in slot one. I kind of like that idea. Let's try a little bit different of a setup. So we're going to try to just put our other Delacium in the front row in hopes that he can replicate some more dots, do a little bit of extra damage in the second round. We still get the huge stun. Wow. Okay. Okay. That was good. I mean, maybe that little bit of extra damage is going to help. We can kill off. Oh, okay. Okay. Big, big. Oh, not enough damage. No. I think that might work though. I actually think that might work. It's so close. All right. All right. Okay, okay. Maybe we need to get that other cruise up to 10 star as well for the double stun. And they will both live the first round. Yeah, I mean, that could be really, really good here. Ooh, ooh, that, that's really bad. So I'm thinking that's what we might do. Either that or I can't decide, guys. Let me know. Should we 10 star the next Delacium in hopes that he can live on the back row? And that way we get more chances for stun. Or do we just get the Cruce leveled up further? We're getting very close to some food here. Not really anywhere else. But I think we're going to try to get the chest from... Uh, from tomorrow's imps adventure event that might help a lot oops i don't want to be here i want to be here yeah there we go there we go let's give it a few more tries and then we're gonna jump into aspen dungeon as well i'm really hoping we can make some progress in aspen dungeon oh that was really bad that was by far the worst scenario we have ever had yikes okay come on quad stun let's see the quad stun right here oh he's got an active yeah that's not good that's not good. When everybody hits him in the back row in the first round, you know we're about to lose very, very badly. Nope, nope, nope. Stop, stop. Okay, that's fine. Only a double stun, not enough. I think we need a quad stun to make it work. Yeah. We're not going to be able to do it with what we got. We're going to have to increase our team's power. We're going to have to increase our Phoenix further. 
Oh, we have the resources now. We don't have the gold. I cannot wait to get more gold. Oh, we need so much gold. We're not even going to be able to buy the offers in here, but we will go in here. We'll give it a few tries. We are in death, though. So that does mean it's going to be pretty difficult here. So it's going to be pretty difficult. Can't. Well, actually, I guess we can. We got, we got a bunch of gold right there from just completing the dungeon or doing the smash. So we'll get a few things, but... Let's see if there's any coins. I think coins are the only thing we're gonna buy here. They're the only things worthwhile. Did I go past them? Nope, that was arena tickets. Nope, nothing else, okay. <laughs> Game, why do you do this to me? Instantly double Ada with this type of lineup. We got to 14 before, which is pretty much what we've gotten to. Oh, did we just lose because Barry did Barry things? Yes, yes he did. We did not use enough demon potions on our Delacium. Good Lord, guys. Good Lord. Rip our dreams and hopes and everything. Man, I just wish I could cut this whole part out. But you know me, guys. I don't cut stuff out. I let you see everything that we fail at and everybody doing berry things. Hey, those of you that are over on Twitch, you guys enjoying that new berry doing berry things emote? It's a good one. Oh man, he didn't even win. So yeah, let's just pretend that didn't happen at all. That didn't happen. Nope, nope, nope. Anyway, back to what we were originally doing. <laughs> oh God, that was so bad. That was so bad, guys. I can't believe it. Even for Barry, that's like, ee, that's really bad. That's really, really bad. Yeah, that's way too many active round one. That's way, way too many active round. We can't even use that queen. That queen is essentially useless to us. And really, we don't have that many debuffs to replicate. So I'm wondering if we should just drop the second Glacium. Oh, good Lord. Good Lord. The amount of crit these guys get is ridiculous. Oh, man. Oh, man. Get some stunnage. No stun. Yeah. We're just going to smash this in the off time because let's be honest, guys. A little embarrassing. <laughs> All right, so the only other thing I did want to jump in and do today, I know this is probably going to be a short one here, guys, but it is what it is, it is what it is. So um, let's take all of this gear off and give that to you and give you that. Drake, you can't even live. We're going to run one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, actually, we'll, we'll throw some other random gear on you just for some extra healing possibilities so yeah i want to test out our broken spaces we are on the huge huge cc wave now yeah we're not even going to run you that's that's pretty pointless you need to make one change here and that is the lacium you need that last there we go there we go i like it i like it i love it let's go let's go get see if we can do some damage because that drake isn't going to do anything for us I like that. That looks good. Come on, team. You can do this. If we could only just smash our way through this and get a little bit more energy as well. <sighs> if only we had energy as well on that Heart Watcher. I want to stack up those attack reduction buffs, but we just can't live long enough is our problem on this team. And then we got the solo Cthulhu, which can probably live, but he's going to do like, I mean, he's doing what? 10 million damage on each around. That's, that's not going to amount to a whole lot of anything. So what are we at there? One, two, three, one, oh, not even a million damage. Look at that. The Delacent was alive for like three rounds. Did almost the same amount of damage a Cthulhu did for the whole fight. Do we, I don't think we even have energy on this account. Do we, do we have anybody that has energy? I feel like somebody has to have an energy somewhere, right? Oh, there it is. There it is. Queen's got it. I forgot all about Queen. So, let's try doing this and hope and pray. Nope, not here. Definitely not here. Man. We're, we're done with here. Let's jump back in here. Let's do this. And with the Heart Watcher round one active, maybe we can get that uh, attack debuff rolling. It's just we have so many debuffs. It's going to be a little sketchy here. Come on, replicate the attack debuffs. Did the, did the attack debuffs already fall off? This is ridiculous. The amount of CC, we even have Purify on that Delacium, and he just cannot live. 
Oh, this is really bad, guys. This is really, really bad. Although we're doing like 1% of fight still. Ah. If we could just get past this one fight, please, game. Replicate the attack debuffs. Oh, okay. Actually, this one looks like we're doing it. Oh, we're, we're actually replicating some attack debuffs? Are we going to be able to live? Probably not. The dots are probably still going to kill our team off. But it's a lot closer. It's, a, it's This one's probably going to have a lot more damage, actually. So at least I'm still going to die off, but... Yeah. And Cthulhu is just going to sit there. Because let's be honest, he probably does more damage just letting them stack up those dots than actually using the active. Alright, I mean, it was more damage. This is kind of pathetic, though. <laughs> You know what guys, you know what, I've had it. We're smashing all 100 in here. We are going to run that with that. <sighs> Let's hope we can at least knock 50% off here. 10 million gold, that's, oh wow, we actually did that in like 80 tickets? Oh wow. Well, wasn't that a pleasant surprise? Okay. All right, let's keep, let's keep going. Let's go back in on this. Maybe we can do a little bit more. Wow, I went, I went like really high pitch right there. <laughs> Come on, replicate those attack debuffs. No, they just seem to be falling off. We need those attack debuffs. Keep spreading them. Oh man, our team is so squishy. We need like an Amon Ra or something like that. But I mean, the Cthulhu lives decently. I saved that and he only... Wait, hold on. One, two, three. Oh my goodness. That was only 200,000 damage. <sighs> you know what we're going to do? We're not even going to run the two crews because I feel like the crews are just adding way too many debuffs here for us to try to like replicate it. I'm honestly just going to run a couple of carries here just for some energy draining and see how that does in comparison. That way there's very few debuffs. We should be replicating that attack debuff much easier. And carries are sometimes draining energy for us. But man, oh man, that uh that Delacium is not healing for very much with his attacks. Yeah, 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 yeah. That was even worse, actually. That was actually worse. The problem with the Delaciums is getting them to live long enough to actually replicate the Heart Watcher debuff. That right there, it just needs to keep replicating, but we're not living quite long enough to make worthwhile of it. It completely fell off. I don't know what to do at this point. And if I'm doing something wrong with the Delacium, guys, let me know, because this is a big oof right here. Like, big oof. We're doing some really, really bad damage. Granted, we have a really, really bad team for doing PvE like this. We're almost geared strictly to seal and progress, and beyond that, not much else. Oh no, that Horrify is gonna kill us. Oh, we need to heal, we need to heal. There we go, that was a nice big heal. All right, another big heal, come on, you can do it, boom. All right, this one will be some decent damage. I mean, I don't think we're gonna get, I don't think we're gonna get very far, but you never know, you never know. Yeah, we keep dying around the same round, but that was a lot better. That was like 500,000. All right, let's smash away, see what we get for our 15 badges. How much did we do? Oh my God. <laughs> yeah, that's not gonna happen, guys. <laughs> That is not going to happen. What do we get? Ah, oh, nothing good. Nothing good. Yeah, Heart Watcher. Sorry, girl. You're just you're just not gonna cut it the way we got you built right now. Not going to cut it. Oi, 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 oi. Oh man, oh man. You know, what if we use energy on this one? Does that do anything? I don't think that does a single thing in Sea Land. I don't think it does. Because everybody that needs energy already has energy. Oh, wow. Wow. Barry, come on now. Guys, this video is completely all 
over the place. Honestly, I should probably throw this one in the trash bin, but let me know what you guys think. I'm going to post it. A lot of times I actually don't put out videos like this where it's just like nothing goes right for us. Do you guys like watching the fails or is it kind of boring? What What is your opinion on this? Because I mean, I could, I could just trash them like I normally do, but I'll give you guys the option if you actually want to see what is happening here. Oh my goodness, this is a horrible, horrible attempt. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> Oh, what is happening here, guys? What is happening? So you know what I'm actually thinking would be better? We got what? One more attempt. What if we were to take this off? Where, where is he? Where is he? Wait, no, this one doesn't have an attack debuff, right? No, never mind. Never mind. Ignore Barry. Barry's doing stupid Barry things, as always. Why does it put that one on? That makes no sense. Why would you put the one star on? Come on, Gee. All right, last attempt for now. I don't think we're going to do it. We've gotten close a couple times in the past few days. But honestly, maybe getting that other cruise up to 10 star to guarantee more stuns would be a good thing. I mean, I would get a Rui Scepter and throw it on there too. But yeah, Rui Scepter Cruise just isn't going to live is the problem. <laughs> He's not going to live. Ugh. All right, I think probably what we will do from the island... The Lost Island. Island Lost. Lost Island. We'll probably just get Profit Orbs. Keep saving up. We do have a ton more gold. I just realized that. Ooh, that's not too bad. That's not too bad. We get some upgrades there. Do we need... I mean, maybe we should invest in some guild tech. But I really want to avoid doing secondary guild tech. Until we get some other classes higher. I mean, I guess I could even go for the HP... <sighs> decisions decisions guys i just don't know what to do on this account i want to prioritize sea land and then at that point i don't even know if i want to feed off the cruise we have but they would be such good food i don't know i have so many questions i have no answers you guys tell me in the comments i'll try to read every one of them for this video let me know first off do you like seeing the fails or should we just put these in the garbage can like we normally do and second is what should we be doing on this account i have no clue Obviously, build the second delay seems going to be a lot better. But beyond that, I have no clue. So let me know what you guys think, and I will see you guys in the next one.